Good afternoon and welcome to New Delhi Railway Station. After leaving Jodhpur, we jumped on around a one hour flight and spent one night in possibly our favorite place in Delhi. Don't judge us, but we love Par Har Ganj. But we came here for one reason and one reason only, and that is to head to Lucknow, our final destination on this two month trip across India. And we will be taking possibly the best train in the entire country for six hours, the Tejas Express, the semi-high speed, the only privately owned public train in the IRTCC. I'm excited. And this is New Delhi Railway Station. It is actually less chaotic than I was expecting. Again, we had to get Raj from train ticket, please to book our tickets. Honestly, if you need to get a train out here, the only way you want to book them is with Raj. This is a pretty cool station. And you'd think by now that I'd be an expert and I'd know exactly what I was doing at each Indian train station. But I'm not. This one seems a little bit different to get in. Yeah, there's like a full-blown airport security to get in this is the first one first station in india where they've scanned your bags we have teamed up with skyscanner to bring you our top travel tips traveling full time for the last few years means hopefully we know what we're talking about we have used skyscanner for every flight that we have booked as it is a world travel engine finding you the best deals on hotels flights and much more the very first travel tip that we have for you is to take photos now we know necessarily that this is not a travel tip but we think it is so important to capture those amazing travel memories the second tip that we have is to not be afraid of street food. <laughs> Lots of people are, but street food is often the best way to learn about the culture and the country. Make sure you look for busy vendors or stalls. It's often where the local hangout is. Uh, street food is cheaper too, so it's a win. Our third and final tip would be to be flexible and use Skyscanner when booking and planning your trips. You can actually use the Explore Everywhere button on the Skyscanner website and it will bring up lots of different random destinations for you in order of the cheapest. So you can save money whilst bagging yourself a spontaneous trip. A massive thank you to our long-term partner Skyscanner and let's get back to the video. This station is absolutely huge. It is absolutely massive. I haven't seen our train up yet. I'm looking out for the 82502. It could well not be here yet. It's surprising me. We're actually really, really early. I made a point of getting here early because obviously it is Delhi, so I was having um, but Whoa, whoa by sub. I haven't yet seen uh, even a table to say where our train is. So. I think it's up there. Actually, I just saw it. It should not be difficult to find our train because apparently, well, actually, I can see we are getting on a blooming gold train. Look at this. We have got some pretty fancy first class trains in our time in India the Vandabarat, the Shatabdi. But this might top them all and you can really see the contrast between the old traditional trains and the brand new blooming <laughs> gold trains. It looks like the Maharaja Express. This is this is very fancy. This is so cool. As you can see, it's just beautifully designed. So um, I've worked out that this behind me actually says Tejas in Hindi and that says AC Cherka. I am actually just reading it from the other um, only carriage. Two classes. two classes, so you've got EC executive chair, which is what we are, and AC. Now, there's a, there's a there's like a trick. So when you get your ticket, it tells you like a number. So we're E1. Right now we're at C6, but I haven't seen E yet. So it's either all the way down there or all the way down there. You would expect 
to see the red carpet coming out like you see on many private trains across India when people get their one two week trips with the Maharaja Express but that costs them thousands and thousands of dollars thousands and thousands of pounds this has only cost us around 25 pounds each for the EC the executive chair I think this is AC so you either get EC or AC but we just need to figure out where to go on India's golden train. We're way too early, I'm just admiring it from outside. It's honestly like the uh, earliest we've ever been. You know we're early as well because the train's not even open yet. Normally when you turn up to the platform, they're open. On? No, you can't get on, that's why. I think they must be cleaning it or something. So we're E1, EC1, and we're at C6. So is that EC1? C1? I'll ask. EC1. E1 it must be. Let me stop, I stop. E? Do you know what E is? E? E? Yeah, but this is C, so where is E? E. This way or this way? C, I think it might be this way. Let me check. Down your bed. I'm not sure. I'm not sure he knows either, to be fair. That's fine. No problem at all. We will just walk. Do you know what? We got about half an hour, so we can just wander. So we have found it, this is us. So you have the AC chair and the first AC chair. I think we might be able to, let me check. No, we're too early. And we are finally, hold on. There we go. We're finally open. Are you okay with that? We're getting used to this, ready? Three, two. Let's go, oh, first thing's first. Pink train, and we're the first ones on. Pink toilets, you mean? Eagle Weaver. Oh yeah, but look at this. Okay, so you've got space for the luggage, and this is us. We are three and four. That's how eager we are. We're the ones. I don't know if that's a bad idea because we're right next to the door, so you know people are just going to be running back and forth. But we are closest to the toilets, and I'm just going to quickly show you what this looks like. Drop it out the top. The carriage. Yeah, put that Take up the top first. Oh. Take up like five seats. Wait, put that at the got... top. Oh, I do like this Wait. though. And you can fit your case. And our suitcase is a big one. Up above you. And this is the carriage. So, so there's EC and, and AC. EC and AC. Okay, so first things first, that person seems a bit too high up. But you have a really comfy little leg cushion thing here. You've got a footrest with a bottle holder. Pass it here a sec. So you can see bottle holder, a little net thing, the foot stool, this cushion where you have plugs and bright lights. And... Blind. We have the whole. Does it work? Maybe when the train's running. Maybe when it's running. I think these are for. That's so cool. The blinds. So you pick the blinds and up. Lights off and on. More lights off and on. You have chargers, and then it's a two-two configuration. Apart from if you book these, and there might be a four of you sit there, and then you have the friendly staff. Hello, Namaste. <laughs> Change your plan. We are in the wrong carriage and <laughs> is there no tv screens no screens you know tv <laughs> television <laughs> no what's your name molly oh nice and hello uh, one sugar hello Hi. nice to meet you <laughs> nice to meet what you what coach are you in yeah. we're all in the wrong coach we're all in the wrong, wrong coach carriage. Oh, what carriage are you two yeah and we're one okay, okay. Yes, this next is my coach. Oh, and we're the one after. Oh, my oh God. okay. We're really lost. Okay, this is now us. And we do get a newspaper for the journey, the Economic Times of India. So I'm going to feel very intelligent as I read this. We do have a bottle of water, like Molly showed, lots of legroom. Everything's the same, mate. Some yeah, of the photos the online. I think it's a lottery. Some of the Tejas Expresses, you'll get a TV screen. Others, you'll get a make life a journey. Make life a changing journey. Let's pledge to travel for life. Everything was a little bit confusing though because we were supposed to be EC1, but the actual little flashing light, EC1 was, was like the other end. The AC third class or AC, AC class. So yeah, I don't know, but I'm hoping we're finally in the right seat. I'm gonna try this. No, I think the train needs to be on. We'll try it when we start moving. I finally figured out that they're now working. Ready? Sorry. Is this a thing? Is it, 
Does it touch? Yeah, you just and then like, you can stop? Yeah. And then we can start? Yeah. I didn't even know that was a thing on India. I need to open. I like to look out at the, yeah. the, the, the beautiful view of the pipe. <laughs> you know what? The good thing about travelling in like the late afternoon is you can get some daylight, you can get some sunset, and then at night you can just see nothing. But this is so cool. <laughs> And we are off on our pole. I thought the door was closing, these are automatic, so I better be careful on our six hour journey to Lucknow, Uttar Pradesh, on India's golden train. This is gonna be fun. Ah, thank you very much. What is this for? What is this for? What is the flower for? For the festival? Okay, no? no okay. Thank you so Thank much. you. Thank you. Thank you, I'm actually not sure what this is for. So I know that there is a current festival in Delhi. Or they're just being nice. What have they put on it? I don't know if you can see, look, because of the lighting. There's like... It smells really good. There's in there. It smells nice, doesn't it? But I'm not sure what There you go, I've got your flower. <laughs> Every time I've been given flowers so far, it's, it's when somebody has me, given it to Matt to give it to me. Hello. Thank you. Thank you, bad. Thank you very much. Welcome, sir. Thank you. It looks good. <laughs> Thank you, bad. Thank you. So this is established so far on these trains in India. Nice. Tropicana. Guava. Sorry, I got a bit excited about that. Guava Tropicana. You get a snack tray like this and then you get your actual meal so we have some almonds we have some bell puri chocolate cake some sort of samosa and your tropicana you know what we, we literally just said that we really fancied like some chocolate or something so i was absolutely chuffed but then i realized it's choco chili i mean of course it's india well, like you can have chocolate <laughs> I don't even think you mentioned train food. I just think it was good. No, it was actually, that's, that's pretty true. It was just pretty solid Indian food. But um, no, 
I get to tuck in to do mine. Oh, what's happening? This is like an extra, I'm not complaining, an extra frozen ice cream. And after just over six hours, we have made it. To the luck now. Great experience. Loved it. Tejas Express, the gold train oh, of India. It will be missed. It really will be missed. We just need to figure out now how to get an Uber to our Airbnb. The first time we have stayed at an Airbnb in the whole two months in India. And that is the most random station ever. You pull up and you're already outside. This is becoming more difficult than I expected. Ubers aren't allowed into that part of the station. Oh my god, what's going on? So we need to uh, go through, I think, which is up there, the main entrance. I have no idea what's going on with that music. I think it's like a, an Indian series. I'm really not sure, but the um, 2,500 rupees was definitely, definitely worth it to experience the Tejas Express. I'm just worried now that we're not going to be able to get a taxi because for some reason they don't let them into the train station. Look at it, and I think this is also the station. It's got to be. Yeah. Now everyone's gonna wave back. Yeah. Hello. Come on, the feast. This has got to be one of the grandest stations I've seen. <laughs> In India, we came out of the little bit behind, but this here is also like a continuation. Where is Nafis? Is this Nafis? Is this him? Is this him? I'm lost. Good afternoon. It's actually the next day we collapsed late last night. By the time we checked into our Airbnb, it was nearly one o'clock in the morning. I'll show you actually where we're staying. We're staying in Gumti Nagar and we found this place. We have a smart TV, really nice sofa, bed, kitchen, everything in between. It's the first time we've actually stayed in an apartment, an Airbnb in India, and it's definitely worth it. There's also like a pool and gym up here and we're staying in like the new part of Lucknow, but the Tejas Express, the only private public train in the Indian railways, I think. The gold train, is it the gold standard? It probably is. We've done the Vandavarat, we've done the Tejas, we've done the Shatabdi, we have done the Vista Dome. I'm actually not sure out of all of them which one is best. Exterior wise, Tejas Express wins by a long way but we do have a couple more days in Lucknow our last destination in India I'm not certain whether we'll get out and film I hope we will so fingers crossed we'll see you in the next one exploring the city of Lucknow here in Uttar Pradesh <laughs>